Hello everybody, I'm meteorologist Cassie Nall and for your Thursday forecast, much like Wednesday, you'll need to keep those umbrellas handy. We continue to have that moisture streaming in from the southwest across the Gulf of Mexico, keeping the clouds around and also the on and off showers. Today for the most part, it's just been some light to moderate rain here and there making the roadways a little slick and in areas where the ground is very saturated that is adding to kind of some of that standing water that we're seeing. We do have flood watches in effect for Charlotte, Lee, DeSoto and Highlands counties through the day today. Because of the potential to see about another inch of rain on top of the three inches or so that they saw yesterday, some areas are reporting some standing water down to the south there. So just use a lot of caution if you're down in Charlotte County in one of those flood prone areas. The heaviest rain today and the potential for stronger storms will be confined to the southernmost parts of the state. So for us, just on and off light rain expected, kind of a drizzly afternoon, good for indoor activities. High temperatures forecast to reach the upper 60s to around that 70 degree mark. Now tonight, the frontal boundary that's currently sitting over the state helping to pull in all of that moisture is slowly going to be drifting to the south, but there's actually a secondary frontal boundary that's going to be making its way into the southeast that's finally going to come through and kick this one on out of here. That's going to get rid of our unsettled weather, but also open the doors for drier and cooler air to come filtering into the sunshine state. So notice tonight, start to see a few of those green shadings coming down here to the sun coast. It'll be a cooler start to tomorrow morning than we've seen the last couple of days. Cooler afternoon tomorrow, and then notice Saturday morning, the blue shading coming over the peninsula here. Saturday, we're going to have a chilly start to the day, but from there, temperatures will actually begin to rebound through the weekend thanks to high pressure that's going to settle in and take control of our forecast. That means looking at your seven-day, the light at the end of the tunnel is that we have a very pleasant weekend ahead here for the Sun Coast. So after the rain chances today, cooler start tomorrow morning, rounding out only in the mid-60s tomorrow afternoon with quite a bit of sunshine expected. Chilly start to your Saturday, though. Starting off the morning in the 40s around the viewing area, temperatures rebound into the upper 60s. By Sunday, we're into the 70s for our highs, and by next week, back up quite a bit above average with mid to upper 70s before the next storm system arrives by midweek.